A Forbes March 2023 article shows that for the first time ever, 10% of Fortune 500 companies now are led by female CEOs. Today, I want to share with you the difference between the hero's journey and the heroine's journey and why investing in female leadership pays off. So to begin with, think about the hero's journey. Joseph Campbell's hero's journey speaks of the man going into the unknown, facing challenges, descending into the abyss, having to find transformation and atone, and then rising, returning victorious. Think Din Djarin from The Mandalorian. Mando has to go and face countless challenges and tribulations, including having to bathe in the living waters in order to come back as one baptized as one in the way and able to adopt Grogu as his child. Grace Kerrigan gives us the alternate version of the heroine's journey. The heroine's journey is a broken down family or system. The female descends into isolation. She is searching for the answer and she does this with helpers along the way and compromise. She brings people together and ascends into leadership, finding the win for everyone, creating a network. Think Bo-Katan from The Mandalorian. She's alone. She sacrificed everything she loved to save her people. She descends into her own story, having to figure out how do I bring the different factions of the Mandalorian people together and inspire them. She unites them together to fight for the cause and win. Research tells us that it is essential for female leadership to help in C-suite roles because of three main factors. Women rank higher in the top five creative dimensions than men. Women play for everyone to win. They look for the win that brings people together and female leaders strengthen connections. The Forbes article gives us fantastic statistics to not only support the fact that female leaders are great for the company and for your team and bringing people together, but they're also great for your ROI. In organizations with at least 30% women in leadership roles, those organizations are 12 times more likely to be in the top 20% for financial performance. Research from the leadership circle based on assessments with over 84,000 leaders and 1.5 million raters. So this is a huge study. This shows that female leaders show up more effectively than their male counterparts across every management level and every age level. If you are a leader on the heroine's journey and you need support, reach out. I have the tools, skills, and strategy to help you rise from the abyss, create the win for your company, and bring your team together. Mm -hmm.